story causing national outrage from Idaho, a state fish and game commissioner has now submitted his resignation tonight after a firestorm over his photos. Lake Fisher emailed images like this one from a recent trip to Africa to more than 100 people. But it was another trophy photo of an entire family of baboons, including babies, that even hunters said crossed the line. Here tonight, ABC's Paula Ferris. This photo from an African trophy hunt has sparked outrage across the country, even within the hunting community. Blake Fisher, the Idaho Fish and Game Commissioner, sent an email with these photos posing with his wife to his family and colleagues. A slain giraffe, a leopard, and this entire family of baboons propped up in poses, including a baby right there in the front. Fisher bragging, I shot a whole family of baboons. Tonight, Fisher resigned after former commissioners and pro-hunting groups demanded he step down, pointing out Idaho's hunting manual, which says to refrain from taking graphic photographs of the kill. To round him up in a big group hug and big smile on his face and with a little baby leaning back with his mom, that, I'm sorry, that's just over the top. Fisher tells an Idaho newspaper, I didn't do anything illegal, I didn't do anything unethical, I didn't do anything immoral. There's a lot of things that are... Uh, legal, but they're, they're unethical and they're wrong. And those who called for Fisher's resignation pointed out the way he described killing that entire family of baboons, saying it was unsportsmanlike and undermined the hunting community. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.